Some say it's the healthcare industry's dirty little secret. Nearly two million Americans contract infections in hospitals each year, and 100,000 die. Why? Bacteria like MRSA, VRE, and E. coli found on bed railings, chairs, and IV poles are multiplying and turning into deadly superbugs. The microbes are everywhere in the room, and we have to break that chain of infection. A U.S. Department of Defense study has proven that the chain can be broken simply by installing metallic copper surfaces into hospitals. In fact, the study proves that hospital-acquired infections were reduced by 58 percent when antimicrobial copper surfaces were incorporated into hospital rooms. Any surface in the room, including the doorknob and the push plate of the hand sanitizer gel, is a good candidate for covering with copper. And with 80 percent of infectious diseases being spread by touch, it's groundbreaking news that copper reduces bacteria levels by a significant 83 percent in ICU hospital rooms. Test results have established copper as the only metal approved by the EPA to make this important claim. The study proves that copper surfaces translate into far fewer patient infections. This is a nationwide problem. Hospital infections cost the country billions of dollars each year in added health care costs, not to mention what they cost people when they lose their lives. Metallic copper surfaces can lower health care costs and help save lives. Product manufacturers have heard the message and acted. We need hospitals to do the same. Learn more at antimicrobialcopper.com.